Not since the horrors of the Black Plague has our land seen such despair. Almost two millennia after Sigmar founded the Empire, the realm is fractured and broken. Three rival factions claim the Imperial Crown, Marienburg, Middenheim, and Reitland. Lure of power brings the armies of men against one another in a seemingly endless tide of battle. An island of peace in a sea of conflict, Mordheim drew wealth such as the city had never seen into its walls. But with its prosperity came the corruption of arrogance and hedonism and greed. The gods could not long abide the outrages of Mordheim's populace. In the heavens, an ill star appeared. A great, twin-tailed comet that some priests warned was nothing less than a hammer of Sigma. They preached tidings of doom and repentance, but their sermons were ignored. An attitude of rebellious revelry gripped the city as the comet grew ever nearer. The grand festival to celebrate the turn of the year was a mockery of the apocalyptic prophecies. It was then that the hammer fell. The fiery comet plowed through the city, gouging a deep crater in the midst of the poor quarter. The wondrous palace of Count Steinhard was broken. The grand amphitheater shattered. The vast great library blighted by a pall of ash. Fire and smoke decimated the populace, but worse awaited the survivors. A malignant corruption that brought with it mutation and madness. The vile taint of chaos. In the shattered city, strange green-black stones were discovered. Strange energies emanated from these shards. Warlocks and alchemists experimented with these word stones and soon determined that their uncanny properties could work wonders. Word stone could heal the sick, regenerate the old, or even turn base metal to gold. Lust for Wordstone focused avaricious eyes upon ruined Mordheim. Treasure hunters descended upon the city, vying with both mutated horrors that claimed the ruins as their own, and crusading zealots who sought to prevent the taint from spreading. Inhuman creatures filtered into Mordheim, staking their own claims. An endless pilgrimage of the greedy and ambitious fighting and dying in a place now called the City of the Damned. And where are the next contenders? Hello everyone, I'm the Island Ranger and welcome to Mordheim, City of the Damned. Just another day in the City of the Damned. Today, we are going to be starting a new campaign. I highly suggest that you look up how um, all the rules, because I have a hard time explaining these things. But I will say that we go over some general rules. First off, when you first start a game, you choose one of four factions. As you can see, there are actually five here. The Witch Hunters, I cannot play as. Mainly because I don't have this DLC. I will instead be playing as the Skaven. Mainly because I've played them the most and I know and I know their campaign, at least the opening four missions, enough to be confident with what to do. Have much, much warpstone. Can she make trouble pain to keep other clans away? Must be swift silent. Not let other clans know, no. We take feds all warpstone. Smart wise Skaven may take much power rank with warpstone. Keep steel from stupid man things and take them to a villain man. Many man things in Mordheim nest. Many other things too. All want take warpstone. And die, die! Sister things from with a high warp stone under four nest. Cult things take warp stone to demon hole. Soldier things take warp stone away to barren things. All must die, die! Skaven, with much warp stone, rise fast, quick and clan. Become big, great chief. Much slaves, much breeders, much power. Become warlord of whole borough, maybe. Best quick trail to rank power is swear, sir, great murder lord Snicket. 
much strong. Most high underling of Clan Ashen's revered feared Night Lord. Even in holy scave and blight, they know of Murder Lord Snicket. Great mighty Snicket. Best of all assassin lords. Maybe becomes Deathmaster someday. And share his glory. Much, much helping Snicket not crush our rivals. Why smart scave and work with Filch, yes? Not never hear learn about Filch Sharp Tail? Hmm? Filch Sharp Tail, greatest killer in all clanation. Filch strangled Wilhelm the Baron thing and make it look like hungry troll ate him. Filch drowned Warlord Kripnik after his ship sink fighting dragon thing. <laughs> Pops keep her bile breath choke on old plague when Filch drops big rock on his tail. Not never he'll learn about Filch. <laughs> Best assassin is one nobody knows. Be proud honor to work for Filch. Filch will let you find much, much words stone for him. Great, great honor. And that's one of the reasons why I like the Skaven. Alright. So welcome to the War Camp. This is where we'll be operating most out of. And we're going to be jumping right into customizations and whatnot. So I'm going to do that um, during the time lapse. Well, I'm going to be doing a time skip. So don't worry about um, watching it. I'll show you what I've got afterwards. Be right back after the break. So, first off, we have our veteran skills. As I said, I have played this game before, and I know roughly what I want. I went and got Haggler and Scholar up to Mastery rank. Give me, um, that way I get more money when I sell items to the shop, and when I learn skills, they're a bit cheaper for me. I've also got Contact Weaponsmith, which will give me a free one-handed weapon. One out of ten missions. Not that bad. The Librarian, which roughly same chance for an enchantment formula, very useful. And also I reduce the cost of getting um, healing my wounded warriors. Now, I'll see you back in the in the Warband Management. So, welcome back. This is the Warband Management, and here is our Warband, Clooney's Horde. With our leader, Clooney the Scourge. And I have a bunch of rats with us, Hooktailed, Split Tooth, Cheese Tooth, and Skeever. All of us are... And as I've, as you probably assume, I went with a red and green coloration. I kind of like the combination with this um, Skaven here. On top of that, the naming is very much like the Red Walls creatures. I mean, Clooney the Skirts, seriously. Anyways, this is what we're going to be running as. Hopefully things turn out well. Alright, here we are on the campaign screen. Average, I'll definitely take that. Launch and deploy. Scouts have reported a rival warband in the vicinity. Before you can find them, a heavy fog settles over the ruins. Unable to pick up the enemy's trail, your warriors deploy from their wagon and spread out to sweep the area in search of your foe. All right, let's get to the action. All right, so our objective is collect all the word stones. And seeing how that's where they're clustered, I think I know where I'm sending all my units. To this far end. Well, because holy crap. That is so damn close to where we need to go. Ah, friggin' A, already? Uh, f failure on... Increased failure chance on all test. Okay, I do not want to send my a hero out into the open by himself right now. So for now, let's have him hide, let's have Hooktail hide in here for now. Wait for the 
backup to show up. By backup, I mean the rest of the army. Who are we up against? We're up against some c cultists. Lovely. Oh, this will be pretty easy. Actually, not really. The cult has a nasty habit of just having a little too much strength. Also that, and they hardly f suffer any all-own tests. So, that's fun. No enemy spotted. Let's start collecting our loot. Primarily, Objectives get the clusters updated. and shards. Yep, we want to collect these war stones because they offer probably the biggest income of gold. Objectives updated. Um, the war stone shard, the war stones. We want to collect as much as possible because that gives us the biggest income of gold. And with that, better, most of our guys can get better skills, and they just become so much better. Ow. Alright, cheese tooth, come on, cheese tooth. Split Tooth, you are the one with. Yeah, you're the tank of the group. Oh, you're designated as tank for the time being. Now we have to wait for the cultists to show up. But. Because we are so clustered here, we want to try and cap get as many of these word stones. Eighteen total in just one cluster, so I think we have a good. Ch if we can collect most, if everyone in my party a new round has, has at least two on them, then not only have we acquired Objectives the most updated. amount of word stones, more out of the two parties, but I do think we also have objectives updated. All right. No cultists have been found yet, so let's go on the watch. Someone's nearby, most likely in the building. I will say this, getting a bonus objective th completed early in the objectives update on your first mission is probably like the best thing you could have happen to you for the time being. All right. Set up a dodge stance. I don't want to I don't want us to get separated too badly. Objectives updated. Objectives updated. Objectives updated. Objective completed. And we're not done yet. Hmm. Just 
now we need to wait for those oh hello there he fails to climb does he completely ignore climbing and no he goes try and climbs again and he finally gets it so that's gonna be a pain in the butt So yeah, lovely, lovely. We got some cultists up in this place, and Split Tooth won't be able to pick anything up. And he won't be able to climb up, so. Okay, we got a Dark Soul coming in. And we engage. Ooh, that's a bit, that's a hit. All right, the Dark Soul needs to die quickly. A new round has started. Cause Cheese Tooth is getting surrounded. Lovely. Um, this might be a bad setup. Oh good, my Vermican cuts off cuts the mutant off before he's in circles and we lose Cheese Tooth. Though it sucks that Cheese Tooth is the one tanking when Split Tooth is the one we need doing that duty. Alright. Alright, at least you got the damage off. Fails the all alone. Don't tell me he flees. Good, he can't flee. Just what I was hoping for. You. Let's try and take down this mutant then and help out Cheese Tooth. Ah, not good. Engage this guy. <laughs> Still sucks that they got a better advantage on us. Yeah, he's gonna try and... Oh, yes! He dodged. Good job there, Cheese Tooth. And there's the Magister. He gets hit with Cross of Miasma. That's good. His defense is lowered. And their magister is leading a giant great sword, wielding a great sword. A new round has started. That is kind of hilarious. He succeeds the all known check. Try and text Puni, but fails epically. All right. He fails the all known check. <laughs> Fuck yeah. All right. He's down. And can we loot the body? Oh wait, I forgot. The only one that can really loot right loot the bot loot bodies is a uh, split tooth. So how about we just go and knock out another enemy? That's more like it. And wow, that guy is really annoying the hell out of me. Okay, now we can come in, engage here. Alright. Oh. 
Okay, I'm gonna have my Vermikin go after... Oh, hello. I'm gonna have my Vermikin go after, uh, That range unit. Instead... Gank him. Well, come up behind him and try and get some... Hits off. With my guy. Ooh, fucking A. That's... That's painful. Good dodge there, Cheese Tooth. Good dodge. We can poison. Okay. Clooney needs backup. Never mind, Clooney just got knocked out. Objectives updated. Oh, fucking I. A new round has started. Okay. <laughs> fucking Dark Souls. Alright. So, uh, Split Tooth, you have to go and pick up the leader's loot because, uh, yeah, everyone else is fucking filled. You just need to pick up two. And just to ensure that you have. you can do it. Ah, oh, shit. How can I? That freaking archer is a pain in the butt. Alright. Their leader's preoccupied right now, so. Heh. <laughs> He's got an arrow on his knee. Ah, crap. I was hoping that would kill him. Actually, no, I'm kind of glad it didn't. Now, if I kill him with Split Tooth here... Uh, that's gonna be another Overwatch shot. Alright. With him down, I can have you sneak, loot, pick up the cluster, Objective completed. Grab everything. Now gate. I should probably shouldn't have dodged. Oh, they succeeded! Shit. Success. He didn't. No wait. He still has a second attack. No, he focused split tooth. That was probably a fatal mistake because now he's gonna lose epically. A new round has started. He's gonna sneak around and kill him. Yeah. <laughs> oh wow! First mission out, and Clooney gets himself KO'd. Good job, Clooney. Good job. Fool things to think want to defy mighty warband. All, all, die, die! Let leave no survivor me dream. Warband grows strong, great. Task. It's listen, follow, wise, filled. Well, that's a, that's very bad. A near-death experience for off the first knockout. Still, we get some good points. And yeah, that was our first mission. It was kind of bad given how Clooney went down in one fucking strike. Pay the warband. Went down so easily, though. It kind of bites. Um, hmm. Get our leadership up and get weapon skill up.
I want your accuracy up. Your leadership up, up. And your toughness up. My vermican. Uh, well, sorry, warp garbs. Now this is my vermican. Alright. Agility and open skill. Alright. So unfortunately, uh, yeah. What a bad mission. Anyways, I'll see you in the next episode, folks. I'm the Other Ranger, signing out.